Hi everybody, hi every spirit, welcome very much to my YouTube channel, Esoteric Cloud Surfer ready to cast the second match out of a best of three between Avely in the color pink playing as a Chinese and in the color yellow it's 3D Dark playing as a Basit Dynasty and the map is the good old Wood Wall. And this map is very characteristic because feudal aggression is really hard to do because your army needs to walk super super long. So that can be really tough to deal with and that could be good for the Chinese player and I mean both these civilizations like to eco up but I would expect 3 to 40 CS from Abbasid because the Chinese player they like to go for stone, second TC, Sog Dynasty, right guys? And they'll be very happy but 3 TCs from Abbasid will already counter that. But both sieves, those are the two most flexible sieves because Abbasid can edge up with different wings and um, Chinese can get all the um, landmarks and unlock different dynasties and whatnot. So they, 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 they can change a lot the course of one game. And by the way, guys, this is a best of three out of the round four from the group stage of the Silver League of the Elite Classic. And you might know about the main event with PST, Marine Lord, Puppy, Wham, the Moo. And this is a group of 16 players that almost qualified for the Elite Classic. And now they are playing in a group stage and one best of three set against each other. So 16 players, 15 rounds, and the best players will move to the top eight. And then uh, follow the tournament from there. So here you have great players as well, like 3D Dark himself. Avely a good player as well, you have Jiwei, you have Divine, Salami, so you have great players, but they don't have usually the opportunity to play a lot of matches in the top cut tournaments, and they also can't accumulate experience and grow on those top level scenarios, so this tournament will give them a lot of time, experience and exposure in a higher level of play, which will allow them to grow. And I love that idea, shout out to DCTV, you guys are organizing a great event over here with the Elite Classic, both the main event and the Silver League. And guys, this is a match from the Silver League, but here on the channel, we also have matches from the main event, so make sure to be a part and catch every match. Barbican of the Sun coming on one side near the berry, near the stone, near Big Gold, getting one relic, but here you could get two relics. If you drop it here, here, you can protect two relics, right? And you can get good deer, ah, but you can get deer here as well. A Basid second TC near the wood line. Oh, this could be early strike from Basid, which is you get a lot of villagers on wood, like a lot of them. You go for forestry and you get a whole bunch of military as well. You cut through and you attack immediately. And your enemy usually on this map will not be ready to defend and protect themselves. Avalee on the Chinese. Going for a second TC himself, and he can he has Song Dynasty, so he'll be producing villagers faster. That's true, sir. Second TC near the first TC, very Chinese classic build. Second TC, and I think there will be more TCs for Abbasid. Abbasid aged up with the economical wing, went for Fertile Crescent. All economical builds, including farms, are cheaper now. Wheelbarrow and Double Broad Axe coming in. Do we have... Not yet the forestry. We could see it today. We could see it. Not yet, I, I think. Bro, this is very interesting because usually these maps or games on this map take a, a while. But I think this one will not. Because I'm seeing a very direct, straight strategy from Dark over here into Avil. Avil is a bit more passive player in my perspective. Dark is a very aggressive player, he likes to play fast. Just a bit like me, I also like to play fast. Three TCs on the berry, on the gold, denying the walls here. Oh, Chinese villager cannot work here. Horseman comes to kill it. Yeah, Chinese villager under pressure. Avely already ahead. But the three TCs from Dark will make that villager count even. All 
might Avery putting some farms here that could be dangerous right guys because if Avery decides to chop through or put a, a keep or a tower or just late game these can guys this can be very exposed so you have barbican defending one side tc and walls defending the other side i like what i see Right, Dark being pushed away from completing the wall. Avely could just build a wall like here or like here in, in the vert, like, like that. Bro, fast castle for both players actually. And Imperial Academy, Imperial Palace here, so you can see. That's true, because th this gives you great vision, so you can see what's going on on the other side. A lot of hills moving to deer. Castle Age also close for Dark. Going with a military wing one minute away. We'll be able to spawn two Camel Riders. And then have a lot of military uh, technologies available. Bro, look at this. No military upgrades, no blacksmiths. There was no units on the Feudal Age. Now we see Spears and Palace Guards coming in from Avoli. Only two barracks working though. Right. Only two barracks working. And what we have here... Uh, more barracks, more barracks. Alright, that will be a palace guard rush, most likely. Oh, Avely, 10 villagers ahead. Even though Dark is on two TCs? Really? Oh, because Avely went three TCs! I didn't even realize it, my bad guys, Avely sits on 3 TCs with Song Dynasty. Bro, that's why he's so ahead. That's actually a great play from Avely. Nobody going for relics. Oh, military numbers start to grow for both players. Walls completed from Dark. Walls completed from Avely. Upgrades coming in, range defense. No upgrades for Avely, militarily speaking, that could make a huge difference on the future fights. Right, guys? Oh, the thing to make uh, siege engines faster. I oh, know it was can't. Oh, no, it's there. Coming in. Also, the mining upgrade. The veteran spear. A lot of upgrades coming in from dark. Range double range defense as well. That that can that will make the difference, because Avely has no upgrades, so he will lose. He dropped the keep over there, which is good for him. Dropping a bunch of farms in the back. Look, 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 look. Abbasid villagers chopping through or getting close to the chop through. But Avely knows about this, I'm pretty sure. Ah! There was an attempt for a forward proxy base from 3D Dark. Did not work. Main army goes in. We can see a battle here. Palace guards out of position. There is a lot of Lombos here for Dark. Doing great damage there. We have a lot of builds here on the berries for Avely. Avely losing two fields so far, not a big deal. He's still more than 10 villagers, more than 15 villagers ahead. Oh, my bad, guys, I forgot to switch. Oh, income per minute. Avely generating so much food. And villagers are about to open. Dark, I think he has a plan. I don't know what it is, but he has a plan. Crossbows, men at arms, and camel riders, and some spears, and one horseman. Coming in hot. I heard a trap. Tra three traps working the keep. Remember that Abbasi, they can build buildings on the field. They don't need to research any technology. They can build siege engine, not buildings. My bad. They can build siege engines on the field. Big fight coming in from 3D Dark. Kind of protecting himself from Avely here. 
Uh, I think he can't manage this. I think this is too much for the units of Dark. But he's opening up the forest here. Then he then he can pass. And then what? And then what, right? You can pass through the forest? A lot of crossbows here doing a lot of damage. Keep goes down. Beautiful. Still nobody grabbed relics, right? Avely now losing villagers on the back of his base. The walls are about to be open here, guys. The gates are about to be open. Uh, guys, what's this? What's going on here? Alright, the traps come out. And they can almost one-shot certain buildings, right? Let me see. Oh, that's going for the TC. Okay. That's a lot of traps working that TC. Let's do it. Good damage. Military buildings from Avely are disappearing. Avely lost so many villagers, bro. And Slav Beast is now defending, but he lost 28 villagers. He's down 20 villagers now. He lost 33 villagers so far. Bro, that's crazy. Great damage from Avely. From Dark, I mean. And it's opening here. He can pass through. He's dropping a keep. He's dropping a keep. Well played, Dark. Let's go. Dark will really enjoy traps. That's true. Zinube on the Twitch chat. Keep gets cancelled. He wants to move it forward. And that's... This is GG. Military. Killing villagers. You lost 40. Lost 50. Three nest of bees. No, hold on. Three nest of bees can kill a bunch of villagers here. But the keep is going up really fast. Five traps can kill any of the landmarks here in the blink of an eye. I think this is game, guys. I think this is game. Maybe we can't do much here. He lost his military. He lost 78 villagers in one attack. He has a keep in his base. He has five traps behind set keep that can just... GG gets called. Let's go. What a game from Dark. That's what I like to see. You go win, you see, and you conquer. GG. Guys, if you enjoyed this one, watch more. Follow me on Twitch. Leave a like and subscribe. It's very Cloud Surfer. Surfing out.